When you have your mammogram at Florida Hospital or FRI, we want you to be aware that a mammogram is done to detect disease that is already present in the breast, but only one part of breast health. The other part of breast health is knowing your risk of breast cancer. The U.S. Preventative Task Force and other national organizations recommend that women over the age of 35 also know their risk of developing breast cancer. And the women that are found to be at an elevated risk are encouraged to receive counseling and education, as well as treatment options. So what does this all mean? Your risk is how likely you are of getting cancer over your lifetime. Basically, someone can get breast cancer for two reasons. There are people who have a genetic risk, who are carriers of a gene called BRCA1, BRCA2, or other genes that increase a person's risk of getting breast cancer. There are also people at risk because of their life events, such as having their first baby after age 30, undergoing a breast biopsy, or simply aging. Before your mammogram, you will have the opportunity to learn your personal risk of getting breast cancer by answering several questions. These questions will be scored using several mathematical models. Once your answers are calculated, you will receive a letter separate from your mammogram results, informing you if your risk is normal or elevated. If your risk is elevated, we would like to meet with you to discuss why and what we can do to bring it back down. We hope this has explained why it is important to know your risk of getting breast cancer in addition to getting a mammogram. To schedule a consultation, please call 407-303-5955.